Ah, nothing like a comfy chair, but what chair are we sitting in, you may ask? Well, this is our own little base that I have established, and when I mean little, I mean little. We have a few crew uh, places, we have all of our workbenches, bed in the corner, and we are currently on the planet Tau Ceti 2, as you can see, excuse me. We'll go out the airlock and I can show you what's up. Um, oh, it just hit nighttime. But this is uh, basically where we're at. We set up a little outpost, which we've named, um, oh, there we go, Sokka Park. I named this place Sokka Park because there are ankylosauruses actually on this planet. Uh, but we are extracting iron and we are extracting uh, this gas over here. I can't remember uh, exactly what it's called. Yeah, Alkins. Uh, so we're storing that. Uh, we have a few uh, containers here. And as you can see, we have the regular docking bay. We have a, a inter, er, an inter-system docking bay. And then we have the big outer system docking bay as well. So I have been busy uh, off camera getting set up. So fully surveying Tau Ceti 2, um, there is no aluminum on this planet. However, it's moon just right here. There is plenty of aluminum right here. So I did set up a base, which I call the aluminum fuel. And essentially we have uh, just shuttle runs going to and from that moon, uh, landing here and dropping off aluminum. So I have everything here that I need. Uh, and this is sort of my, my staging area getting everything uh, gathered up here so that when I do find a planet that I really want to settle on, uh, we can just do the big exports from this system. And speak of the devil, here comes the next aluminum shipment now. That's heading into these containers here, so we have a bit of an overflow of aluminum, but as you can see, both of these containers are full. We could always add more, really pad our aluminum gathering efforts, but uh, yeah, good. You know, regular visitors to and from. But today's first order of business, we're heading back to Alpha Centauri to speak to Vladimir. So we'll be on our way shortly, power up the grab drive, and we will be at the eye before you know it. And I straight ahead will be here just in a moment to speak to Vladimir. All right, Andreja, we're here. And like you, like you said, we're not gonna mention uh, anything about your mission to old Vladimir. Greetings, Captain. Greetings, Vasco. Hey, Vladimir, we have returned. Everything is awesome. Now that those artifacts aren't just blips of hope in the Blackest Sea, I found an interesting pattern. Oh, yeah? The grav anomaly generated by one of those artifacts, it matches one on another planet. A bigger one. All right. So that doesn't make any sense. The artifacts are roughly similar in size. The ones we found, anyway. No telling what this is, but you can feel that excitement in the air, can't you? It's something important. I'd say. Going to send you the mark close as I can, but I'm having trouble pinpointing the source. You'll need to explore the area on foot. Put your scanner to work. Don't know what you'll find. Keep your eyes open. Always do. All right. Land near the anomaly, use my scanner. Got it. And from there, Maybe you catch a smile and uncover the source of it all. All right, go to Procon 3. All right, Andreja. I hope you're ready for some, uh, some combat because while we do have a destination in mind, uh, I have another one that we need to head to first. I want to head to, to, to Denebola B, where we found that uh, secret installation message and uh yeah i, I think i want to head there now that i got andreja a, a combat veteran uh will be good i think for whatever may meet us there so we've been to olympus can we make the jump to voli yes we can just barely in freestar collective space outstanding let's go grab jump spinning down welcome to freestar space we're going to do a quick scan for contraband and you can be on your way all right, Freestar Space. First time I think we've been in Freestar Space scan next to complete. Voli. Go ahead and land. Nah, we're not gonna land, but what we are gonna do is scan. Just sort of, sort of take a gander of what's here. So a bunch of water and some benzene. Now benzene is kind of, um, 
Difficult to find. Oh, that's where Neon is? I've heard of Neon. So it's primarily a water planet with just like one city? Interesting indeed. But that's not our goal. But that's good to know exactly what's going on. We are heading to Den... Den yeah, we can't make it to Denebola without going to Pirama first. All right, off to Pirama. Greetings, pilot. This is Jiro Sugiyama, head of Paradiso Security. Paradiso, eh? I apologize for coming over this emergency channel, but we are in need of assistance concerning the large ship in orbit, and we value discretion in this matter. You mean this one? If you are willing and able, please see me as soon as possible at the main security office in Paradiso. Over now. Interesting indeed. Very large ship, and security has no idea what they're doing here. Unidentified ship. Alright, I'm not going to be deterred from my goal, but this seems like something we can do definitely on our way back. You stay right there, unidentified ship. Security, hang on just one moment. So, Porama 2. Extreme oxygen, a powerful magnetosphere. Moderate flora and fauna, and uh, water, chlorine, lithium, and cesium. Interesting enough, an extreme environment, so not much of a paradise, a paradise at Paradiso, it don't seem. But now is the time. Denebola straight ahead. Not sure what we're gonna find when we get there. But let's jump to it. Jump complete. Wanna do it again, just for fun? All right, I'll stop so we don't go slamming into something. So we're at Denola 1. We need to head to Denebola 3. But it doesn't hurt to scan this while we are here, of course. Marginal weak magnetosphere, lots of resources though. And it's not an e extreme environment, so we can set up with our limited knowledge of outpost building. Might not be bad, but where exactly is Deno Denebola 3? Oh, Denebola 1B, secret outpost, right on the bottom. All right, sure, set a landing target, let's get there. Right, it's sufficient. Sit down. The Lair of the Mantis. All right, not exactly sure what the Mantis is, or if we are gonna be uh, in a good way to see it. All right, Andreja, let's make sure everything is set, so pistol, is good. Yeah, we've 80 rounds, plenty of rounds there. Shotgun is all set. Nice. Hunting rifle set with just two full magazines. All right, let's go in with pistol for now. Not sure what we're gonna see when we get on the surface. This here is our flight, so you can get the hell out or we'll kill you. The lair of the mantis is ours. Five, four, all right, they're gonna get hot. I think now's the time for an injection of heart plus. 20% health for two minutes, 200 extra damage resistance for two minutes. Andreja? Get the hell out now. Three, two, oh, oh. Ah. I the nice. Enemy is All right, spacers are aware. Oh, Vasco going to town as well. Come here, spacer punk. Where are you going? Dip, duck, dive, and dodge. Always worth checking. Never know what you might find in their pockets. All right, move, move, move. Step up, step up, step up. Where did he run off to? He's around here somewhere. All right, in we go. This looks like some sort of launch bay. Hopefully it's not a freaking missile or something like that. All right, work our way down. Spacer Punk, ahoy. Nice. All right, here they come, Andreja. Oh, energy weapon. Grenade. Make our way to the left over here. Where'd you go? There you are. Oh, 
behind the rock. Andreja, you good? Nice. Where you at? Dead in the bush. All right, let's regroup. Top off. Outstanding. Prognosis improved for a sprain. Yeah, it looks like we're sprained up. We might have a uh, bandage that we can put on this sprain to deal with that. So we've got some joint pain. We're, we're stable, but I'd rather get rid of the sprain while we can. There we go, immobilizer. Dislocated limbs, fractured limbs, fractured skull, sprains, and torn muscle. All right, sprain is cured. Now sneaking will not take oxygen. All right, let's get everything reloaded and reset. What did you have? Galvanized, calibrated, ground crew, something or another with a shrapnel grenade. Spacesuit, eh? Well, let's see if we can put her on. Yeah, since we're wearing that legendary reactive refined star roamer, uh, this thing is worse in about every other way, unfortunately. So, some good, uh, some good money. Right, Andreja. Lair of the Mantis. Free and clear with some lockers. Let's do some investigating. Don't know if there'll actually be Rhapsody on Windy Night. T.S. Eliot and A Tale of Two Cities. It was the best of times, it was the worst of times. No message except, of course, happy birthday. Starlock board game. Soap dispenser, I wish that would be good to cure cuts or abrasions. Salmon? Red Rover. Come on over. Red Rover, Red Rover. Oh, I thought that was a digipick. Nope, just a regular ye old pen. Bake a boat. Learn more about the lair of the mantis and explore the lair of the mantis. Certainly, we want to learn more. Spacer, all this, it ain't real. See a spacer. Pick a boat. I hate shooting them in the back like that, but they were trying to get help. Excuse me. Grenade out. See a spacer, punk. Well, if they didn't know we're here, they definitely know now. Oh, a trauma Best pack. To leave anything useful behind. Indeed, especially aid. Lair slate, the gold mine. Credits. Okay, lots of credits and a rip shank. Come here. Woo, big spacer scum. Now I believe you are. Don't you run. Let's hold here, Andreja. Or are they trying to work their way back around? Very, very sneaky, sir. All right, let's see what this is all about. An automated message. You are doing well, Leon. Almost there. I know. Things have been difficult. The mantle of the mantis is a heavy burden. I wonder if it's a title. You can do so much good. So I met with a lawyer and was prepared to party. Hard. The video will was... Mom died about 15 years ago. Mom nice. didn't look good. But it was mom. As weird, crazy, and cryptic as ever. Yeah, we'll get that here in a second. Never even had a son. It was hard to hear. Almost touching. But then the punchline. No inheritance until I go to mom's secret. Stop like this. And she ends not with an I love you or an I'm proud of you. No. 
Six Semper Tyrannus. Six Semper Tyrannus. God. Always with that stupid Death last thing. Over and over she'd say that damn thing. Thanks, Mom. Thanks oh so much. So we did pick up some information? Let's listen to that information, as well as uh, assign our point. I think since we might have a lot more stuff to sell, let's grab the first rank in commerce. Buy for 5% less and sell for 10% more buying and selling unique items. So we can definitely find some unique items around, like uh, this coachman, for example. Andresia can pick up, ooh, body bags some of the slack here if we do get overwhelmed let's just take whatever we can that is light to help us out with that task of buying and selling unique items yeah we're out of grenades unfortunately I don't think we have a grenade to chuck down there but that seemed to be where they were congregating Nice. Looks like a personnel area. Expert safe. Cool. Got a frag grenade back. There we go. And then we'll use the single lady. Outstanding. Hitman's professional refined side star epic pistol. 15% damage while aiming. Minus 15 while on a planet, but it is suppressed. That's really good. So yeah, higher damage, higher magazine capacity, higher range, better accuracy, modded. Yes, please, and in fact, we'll put that in slot two. This'll be our new pistol. All right, so there was the Lair Slate Gold Mine. This Lair's a gold mine, the Mantis was loaded. All the good stuff's gotta be further in. Payout's gonna be extreme, gotta survive. Traps took out Carver and Jiang. Livy volunteered a couple others from Iron Dave's crew. Stay off Livy's radar. Sorry, punk. Nice and quiet. Did they have anything of value? Yes, ammo, if you're wondering. Pick a boat. Nice. Andreja, you going to uh to go get some or are you just gonna hang out? That's cool. Nice. Expose your knee. Yeah, a nice grenade down there would be awesome, but Andreja is picking up the work. Oh nice shot, Andreja. Get that punk exposed, just like that. Alright, where are we at? Alright, punk down the way. Hello. Not walking out. See if you can force him out of his hiding place. Nice. Nice. Alright, he's down. Yeah, keep popping your head out and see what happens. On the right. Nice. Andreja, you got these guys? Nice. Lair Slate, Leon's corpse. All right, so Leon's corpse as well as spacer communications. Found Leon's body. Looks like one of the traps got him. Big fight over his body until Iron Dave broke it up. Managed to grab his cred stick. Wonder if Mantis' own son got nixed. How do we do any better? Uh-oh. And spacer communication too? Spacers. You know who you are. Because that's what they call us, isn't it? The ones in charge. The ones who never respected us. The Free Star Collective. The United Colonies. Even the Crimson Fleet and the Clintic. They see us as the leftovers. The unaligned space scum running rampant across the settled systems. And you know what? Maybe they're right. But so what? 
We matter just as much as they do. We deserve just as much as they do. A lot of you have been all over. You've seen the empty buildings, labs, factories, whatever. They're out there, lots of them. Abandoned after the colony war. And those others? They want them. They're taking them and everything inside. Are you gonna let them do that? You gonna let them get away with that? I'm not. Your eyes open. I want Spacers my fair share. Anywhere. And I don't know about you, but I'm ready to take it. All right. Spacers uh, got motivation. All right, so I think we're okay down to here. The drum beat, I think we already have one of those. All right, so we are over encumbered. So let's get this body. A frenzy coachman with shotgun shells. Yeah, we'll take a look at that coachman. We're not really a shotgun user. Mantis revealed. I mean, the Mantis is a fairy tale. Someone to keep pirates from going off the deep end. Oh no, I think I, it's real. I, I guess it's possible. She never talked about where she got her fortune. And man, she could handle herself anywhere. It's a, a lot to take in. All right, outstanding. Got that? 67 bucks, hey, Andreja. Got something for ya. All right, frenzy coachman set get the pistol back and keep on keeping on deeper so Leon's mom looks like spacer territory be ready for anything is the mantis hello punk oh come on Andresia clear my line of fire Andresia I would appreciate it if you didn't go walking back and forth in front of the doorway Nice. Go away. Next room looks like a few might be here. No, that's the credits you were spelling. Hopefully they amount to something. Oh. Civilians as well. Talk to Livy. Sorry, Raider scum. Woo! A vulture! There we go. Got her moving. Antiseptic calibrated. Okay. There, there's a grenade we needed, of course. Final recording for Leon. All right, let's listen to this final recording. <coughs> Turrets. Turrets. Mom, why the hell? This whole thing is a sick joke. <coughs> Gotta get out. Oh, God. Yeah, that didn't go well, eh? Oh, nice. So what are you on about, Livy? Wait, wait, don't shoot. I am unarmed. Yeah, I know. Look, we can help each other. I can be useful. Just don't kill me. All right. So tell me who you are. Livy, and I mean you, uh, no harm. This place was full of traps. Traps everywhere. I removed them. But this, this corridor is just too dangerous. See? Looks normal. Of course. One step inside, slam! You are trapped. And nobody's been standing after the doors reopen. Gotcha. All right, how'd you deal with the traps? No, sorry. If I tell you that, then I lose my leverage. They're ingenious. Took a, a lot of lives to tease them out. So I, so I saw. All right, it looks like this place really tore you apart. It's true. So many of my crewmates are gone. And this corridor is the worst. But I figured it out. There are letters on the floor. Okay. There's a grid. Those letters must spell something. Six Emperor Tyrannus. So many words or small phrases. All right. How many words have you tried? Five, 
Six? It's hard to find... Uh, volunteers. I really thought we had it with M. Mantis. Ah, oh, poor Fred. All right, you're smarter than you look. Why does everyone always say that? See, I've been helpful. You... you could let me go. Or better, I can help. I know these traps. I know how this Mantis thinks. Please, let me help. And just give me a taste of the cachet inside. You can trust me. You how realize come... that, of course, you cannot actually trust him. That's exactly what I was thinking. Alright, you really think I'm going to trust you? Trust is maybe too strong a word. We need each other, so we use each other. There you go. Then, when the arrangement is no good, we decide then? Yep, betray me and die. Spoken like a true spacer. You won't regret this. I will hold back here. And, well, good luck. All right, Livy. I'm on to you. Yep. Just keep that in mind, buddy. All right, words on the floor. Resume last session, eh? The lock is too difficult. Oh, a master. Yeah, unfortunately, we are not a master. Otherwise, we could just turn the whole thing off. So I'm looking at Tyrannus, eight letters long, and there are eight rows of letters. Andreja, you just hold right there, eh? I do not want you stepping. T? Yes, indeed. Y? R? A? N? Be careful on the sidestep. N? On the right. I. Is that an I? Kind of looks like an I. Dang, paint. An S. Tyrannus. Alright, are we good? I think we're good. Andreja, are you with me? Alright, let's get in here. Oh, them single ladies. We can succeed at that before we are discovered. Indeed. A casual hat, sure? Alright, modified arc welder, but I'll take the laser cartridge. Drink pack for white wine. And some cheese. Robots. Probably turrets. Very dangerous. Olivia, you coming with us? Alright, indeed. So we got through the trap. Got him disabled. And now you're with us. So no funny business. Oh, turret. All right, let's peek around. A 20 mark turret. Nice turret down. Yeah, I'm gonna need a bit of the long gun, I think, for these long hallway turrets. So far, so good. Be advised that hostile. Oh, robot! Woo! Pump him full of lead. No, you can't sidestep. You can't run. These things are taking a pounding. Probably need some electrical weaponry if I have to make a guess. These guys are probably armored to the teeth. And the bad thing about it, I only have two energy weapons. The cutter and the arc welder. Well, crap. So we'll keep the arc welder on. Oh, hey. Winner takes all these different, is it not? Indeed. Now, if we see anybody, but we shouldn't see anybody going forward. No one could make it past the letters. So we'll keep an eye out for any more robots. Oh, yeah, just keep on going, buddy. Tr trigger anything that's gonna blow up. Be my guess. Freaking imbecile. Nice. The lair. Finally made it. We, 
We have not been to the lair of the mantis yet. We are finally here. Hello, robot dog. No, that's not going well. I'd like to turn it off. Ooh, did our boy get got? Nice. Well, sorry about you, Livy. Oh, I thought that was another robot coming up. All right, so best scenario, even though they might be weak to laser damage, stick with the ballistics. Another doggy over there. Ooh, okay, okay. Got some espresso. As a matter of fact, we have some aid that might be able to help us before we go out there to the doggy. Like the Doro Watt? Yes, indeed. And then we'll take another shot of Heart Plus. All right, let's go. Fully reloaded. So these robots. Nope, they're enemies. Boom! Well, that's one way to do it. Andreja, keep me covered. Nice. You fall down, go boom. Woo! You jumping up Terminator style. Right, I think we have cleared. Oh, hello, Mantis Computer. Scorched Earth. Process Scorched Earth has detected three unclosed documents. You've earned it. Strike fear into the heart. They believe they are above the law. I've been forced to take lives, but the first time I did so as the Mantis. The Mantis ship Razor Leaf was light years above everyone else. Oh man, perhaps Dory had cancer or something of that nature. You only have a year to live. She wanted Leon to take over. Well, we are the Mantis now. And so she kept herself in shape, waiting for the time when the Mantis would rise again. The Incendiary Mantis Pack, the Reactive Mantis Spacesuit, and the Sensor Chipped Mantis Space Helmet. Yeah, with the Mantis Spacesuit, we gain a ton of physical resistance as well as electromagnetic. Energy goes down by 20. But it is also reactive, so we don't lose that. Radiation resistance goes up in 15% less melee damage. All right. Nice, the incendiary mantis pack, everything goes up except airborne, but radiation goes up a ton. It's lead line, incendiary, igniting nearby attackers. Nice, we'll do that. Corrosion resistive, 20% accuracy when firing on the move, increasing our physical energy and electromagnetic resistances. All right, so we are now the mantis. Oh, hello, the workbench room. This place might hold some goodies. Microscope. Tank with nothing in it. I wonder what she was keeping in there. Research lab, the industrial workbench. This definitely seems to be a bit of a, oh, a poison barrow knife. Charter, shotgun shells, vanadium, and structural material. Aromatic and biosuppressants. Yeah, we'll take those.
Oh, nice. Did you pick for my troubles? All right, all right, all right. Yeah, it'll be nice to get back. Well, to the ship, but not just our ship. I believe we have a ship that we can claim just in here. Oh, security computer. All right, security log. Security offline. Defense contingency scorched earth, mainframe failing, hard wipe, 97%. Scorched earth was interrupted. Data was unrecoverable. All right, so really no record of anything that was going on here. Which to be fair, a good process, I suppose. Dang it, we need zero wire, but luckily we have enough goods at our new base that we can manufacture zero wire fairly easily now, thankfully. That was a hard road to hold. Starship lift controls. Oh, and it's going back up to the surface. All right, so hopefully, no one's gonna be outside to say, oh cool, a ship just appeared. We're, we're gonna take that. And luckily it seems that this handy dandy lift goes right to the surface and I'm a little bit confused why we just didn't take this down. Come on, Andreja, get aboard. Aha, secured access. And luckily, we can just uh, open the door. So where does this pop us out at? Oh, right by the uh, automated message. Yeah, I didn't even see this thing here, as you can see by my missing 150 credits. All right, all right, all right. Yeah, so uh, yeah, let's get out of here and take a look at our new ship. What do you say? Take what you must. Leave the rest for the scavengers. So the scavengers, when you when you say the scavengers, do you know who's coming up after us and picking up all the pieces or is that just uh Ooh. Take a look at this. Ooh. Yes, let's get aboard. Take a look at this. The Razor Leaf. All right. Roomy, spacious, lockers. Looks nice and homey. A bit cramped, but it'll be interesting to see what it can do. Oh, okay, okay, okay. There's our locker. Where is the cargo storage, by the by? Right here? Yes, indeed. So we've got two comms relays and some itterbium. We'll go ahead and take that while we're here. And then uh, if this becomes our ship, the rest of our cargo should shift in here. All right, let's warm our buns, shall we? All right, I think I know how this works. Let's get off this rock. And it is our new home ship. So we'll definitely take a look at the stats of this thing and compare. Red Apogee, surrounded by stars and the vastness of space. Outstanding, and take a look at all the power we can allocate. So we'll put in one to the grab drive, an extra one to the shields, boost that as high as it can. That leaves us three left over. Okay. Yeah, I don't think we need much engine. We'll make sure that our weapons are nice and powerful. All right, so our Frontier has a lot less power, that is for sure, although we have a little less on the cargo side. Frontier held 450. And we're at four, 221 of 420. We do have a lot more hull, though, at 469 compared to 366. Lots of fuel. Holy crap, but jump capacity. 
is still 16 light years. All right, 546 on the shield compared to 372. Particle weapons, 14 to 16, 47 missile to 36. So our missiles are not hitting as hard, but dang, I tell you, what a ship indeed. And yes, indeed, all of our goods have been transferred on over, it looks like. We're carrying 221 of 420, so that's all the stuff I was carrying on the frontier. 